What's up? It's me again. Told you I'd do another video. So now we're gonna do uh, some co-dominant traits, genetics for ball pythons. Um, yeah, that's my tarantula. I got bored, so thought it'd be a nice little addition to the video. Um, basically. For a list of codominants, like if you guys are wondering, for recessive albino, ghost, caramel, xanthic, piebald, clown, genetic stripes, things like that are considered recessive or are recessive. And then for codominant, you have your pastel jungles, pastels, yellow bellies, mojaves, platinum, butter, cinnamon, fire, spot nose, and so on. <coughs> Alright, for codominant, this is another video, and we're going to do start out with a het times a normal. If you mix a het, heterozygous, say we do pastel, heterozygous pastel times a normal, 50% of that clutch should be pastels, and then the other 50% should be normals, and that's once again how it should be. And then het times het, you should get. 50% should be pastel jungles, or your pastels. One should be a super pastel, and then one will be a normal. So in this case, head times head, you're not going to get any heads. It's just how it is. Okay, a homozygous times a normal. You should get all pastels. Should get, once again, should be. I'm not going to say I'm a pro at any of this, but this is what I know. Then once again, say you did something like a super pastel times a regular pastel, you should get 50% pastels, 50% super pastels. And that would be homozygous, super pastel, and still homozygous, pastel. And then if you did homozygous times homozygous, in this case you did a super pastel times a super pastel, you should get all super pastels. And you could also breed down did a, like I said earlier, I guess a super pastel times a normal, you should get pastels, you can get some normals, maybe in a super pastel, <coughs> but that's a quick overview on co-dominant, um, once again I'm not going to say I'm a pro, but this is just a general guidelines or kind of what could happen, what should happen, really basic, but you know, if you're starting to get interested in it, this would be a good place to start at and some good stuff to know. So, that's it for co-dominant, and we'll see you guys later.